Hey guys, so this is Nate and it's May 27th, 2023 and I'm making a video about uh, my nipple, my one nipple, this guy right here. So I previously made a video but I think I talked too much or something. So I this video is going to be really, really short because I'm going to try something different. I'm going to try to be direct. So um, I made one video about my top surgery. And then I made one video about my nipples, which I actually removed that video because I'm going to remake that video and I'm going to do it better. So I'm sorry about some of the repeat videos for some of my uh, subscribers who do always watch them because there is going to be some repeated content. Um, so anyways, um, so I never mentioned in my nipple video or in my top surgery video that I have one nipple that's kind of dead. Um, it's not actually dead. It exists. But so this nipple here, I don't want to see my face. Right here, you can see it actually pops out and stuff. It still has a little bit of a pink in it, but not really. But it does pop out. It's very, like, alive and well. And, like, I can feel all of this. I mean, I can even feel that. Although, I can't feel everything. Just saying. Um, this nipple is the one where... And it looks like I have dog ears. And that's what I was trying to say in the other video. But this nipple doesn't really have a center nipple. Like, it does. It's kind of, like, right there. Like, I'm not touching my... Like, okay, so my nipple... My finger is not over the nipple. It's pointing to where the nipple is, if you get what I mean. This is what gets hard, kind of over here. Sometimes, very rarely, I can see it get hard right in the dead center, but it's really rare. Um, like, I actually want to stand in front of the air conditioner and try to get it hard, to be honest. I know, that's kind of gross, but let me try that, just so I could show you, like, sometimes it does exist. Um, I mean, you could see it in my top surgery video, but so brief little update so if you watch my nipple video this is not new information so you you know feel free to click away if you've already heard this um but so i went to uh get my nipples tattooed after top surgery because of the discoloration um and the ink all fell out and i did this twice i did this at uh six months post-op and eight months post-op both times the ink fell out but at six months post-op this nipple, so this nipple was always popped out, okay? This nipple was like, it didn't pop. And then after the first tattoo, it popped a little. And after the second tattoo, it popped. Like, it actually exists sometimes. So, yeah. So, I mean, I'm really happy with my results. I don't really care that this nipple doesn't pop or isn't dead center, I guess. It, I mean, like, sometimes, very rarely, it, it is a dead center, perfect looking little nipple. But she did kind of shave a little bit too much off of it. Um, so yeah, that's that's it. Um, I just feel like you guys should know that like, even though my top surgery went really fantastically well, not everything was perfect. And uh, But nonetheless, I'm still really happy with my results and I'm just really glad to have nipples despite how uh, useless they are anatomically. But I'm really happy that they exist. So. Yeah, really happy with my results still, but just wanted to let you guys know. Uh, thank you guys for watching.